question. Ja, då hälsar vi hjärtligt välkomna till dagens presskonferens från Guldfågeln Arena. Jag börjar med att lämna över ordet till KMF sportchef Jörgen Pettersson. Varsågod. Tack för det. Eh, ja, jag har bjudit in idag till eh, att eh, prata med en ny spelare inför 2022. Eh, som alla vet så har vi haft eh, 2021 där vi har haft eh, två målvakter med utgående avtal. Så det har varit ett prioriterat område att titta över. Och, eh, Därför har vi idag Ricardo Friedrich här. Välkommen. Welcome. Hi. So we could. <laughs> um, he knows a little bit uh, Norwegian, a little bit Finnish, some Turkish okay. and fluently English. Yes. So very welcome to to Kalmar FF and to, to Sweden. Happy to be here. Thank you. Ready for questions? Kommer några frågor? Uh, Ricardo, uh, what makes you the decision to come to Kalmar? Wow. Well, um, there are many, many facts that uh, brought me the assurance that Kalmar was the, the right step for my career, for my, for my life. I said it before, uh, since the first time I've spoken with uh, Jorgen and, and Henrik, uh, it just felt right. Uh, I think uh, we kind of match the things we're looking for, and that brought peace to my heart to make this decision and and move to Kalmar and, and you know embrace this this project. Uh, Also bringing my family with me that would be very important, and I know the the town. It's uh, it's a football town, and uh, everybody is involved. So I come from a football family as well, and I know how important that is to to have all people connected, and you know, moving with the club, and uh, so it's it, it was at the end quite clear for me that that was the, the right step for, for my career to, to move to, to Kalmar FF. Have you played for go? And how, uh, how long is the deal? Jorgen can answer that. <laughs> uh, it, it's a long term contract. It's more. It's more than two. <laughs> like that. Har vi fler frågor? Vad säger du, Jörgen? Vad är det som har gjort att du har fastnat för Ricardo? Det har varit ett bra scoutingarbete av Peter. Vi började ganska tidigt eftersom vi två år i sträck har varit i samma situation egentligen. Vi hade Tobbe kvar på två år. Men, men Luka skrev ju ett och sen ett igen. Så vi började ganska tidigt att både utvärdera och analysera och titta på en hel del namn. Och det här var väl kanske inte riktigt att vi trodde att vi skulle kunna gå i land med. Eh, väldigt bra bakgrund. Eh, tre år i Bode i, i deras väg upp till elit. Och även lagkapten i Bode. Eh, bra ledarskap. Jättebra ännu mer både från Finland och Norge. Och en bra säsong i, i, i Turkiet dessutom. Så bakgrunden och sen även det här personliga mötet vi hade där, där drivkraften är väldigt, väldigt tydlig. Så det har varit viktigt. Hur skulle du eh, beskriva det, Karadu, som målvakt? Eh, orädd. Eh, explosiv, väldigt bra en mot en. Bra tillslag, bra i spelet med fötterna. Så ganska komplett målvakt. Jag tror att du förstår mig. 
Ricardo, can you describe yourself as a goalkeeper? What are your strengths on the pitch? I knew that was coming. Yeah, I told you. <laughs> uh, uh, soon you see, I hope, on the pitch uh, some of my skills. But um, what you can expect is an uh, offensive goalkeeper. Uh, it's not playing on the line. Uh, I like to describe as a, a pro proactive. So I'm really trying to, 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 to be on the game, to be active. Or, and to be helpful covering the, the, the gaps, co covering the space, not only the goal. Um, but uh, uh, part of that, uh, I think uh, I have to see how I will fit in in the, in the squad and uh, we'll get the instructions from Henrik, from, from Donald, goalkeeper coach. And I'm also open to, to if I have to adapt anything anyway. It's, it's, uh, it's a uh, work that we have to, to do and we're just starting now. It's, it's good to be here to, to, to meet, the, meet the team and uh, you know get to know more about Kalmar and so this brings me a good feeling for next next seasons. It's your first time at Guldfogen and I here today. Can you tell us a little bit about your first impression of the stadium and the club? Oh, uh, let's talk about expectations. Of course, uh, I have had the chance to, to look into it before coming here, and you kind of had ha have an idea, but uh, I arrived yesterday evening in Kalmar. And uh, again, it just, it just feels right. Uh, I just feel like uh, we have everything to, to for this uh, you know, partnership wor work out. And, being here in the stadium, meeting people uh, that I already was in, in touch for quite a while and have helped through this this proce process in you no know, paperwork, everything. I, I really appreciate everyone that uh, has done it to me and to my family. That was quite important. And uh, just before now, I have uh, just taken maybe 10 minutes outside just to, to breathe a little bit of the fresh air and kind of a picture how it's going to be the future and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just really happy to be here really I, I, with time you get to know me get as a player as a person and and uh, I just it just feel, feels right feels right to be here Have we have to Ricardo or to Jürgen Petson? You, you came from uh, Ankara Gucci in uh, Turkey what can you say about your time in Turkey? It was uh, quite experience as uh, all other <laughs> other uh, other clubs I have I joined and uh, countries. It was my my third country and such difference living in Scandinavia to to Turkey. But um, I had I had a good time there. I, I met good people. I had good connections. I I play football in the highest level with. Uh, Full stadium, so the the environment you ex, you can expect, uh, and that was something that was I, I wanted to experience. Uh, there's the other side of it. Uh, unfortunately, I was the the whole time there alone because the pandemic came and my pregnant wife at that point couldn't travel. Uh, so yeah, my my son was born in Brazil. Uh, I managed. With uh, with a, a miracle to to one day I will talk more more about that maybe, or you can read in the article, in the website. Um, so I, I managed to go to, to to Brazil to to see his birth, but had to go back to 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 Ankara. So uh, in my personal life was was quite tough to be away from my family, from my wife, from my from my son, and football wise um, brought me a different idea about football in general and as as i said any other experience uh, i have tried to take the best from from this and learn on the pitch and off the pitch so i i i can say that i succeed because i'm sure i can go back there anytime and and get in from the fr uh, front door so this for me it's a goal i have for my career everyone everywhere i go I wish I can always be welcome back.
Wie Claire får gå. Då tackar vi Jörgen och Ricardo. Och sen finns det möjlighet för media att göra privata intervjuer efter presskonferensen avslutar. Tack så mycket. Tack så mycket.